All right, so let's start with some breaking inputs that have just come in from Afghanistan, where there are reports of a suicide car bomber who detonated his explosives close to a public protection unit in Ghazni. Now, according to preliminary reports that have just come in, about 23 people so far are said to have been killed and 16 others have been wounded in this suicide blast at the public protection unit in Ghazni. Now, the spokesman for the provincial governor, Wahidullah Jumazada, has confirmed the explosion that took place earlier this morning. A security source has said that the bomber detonated a Humvee vehicle which was full of explosives and army commandos were also based in the compound. According to the security sources, no group so far has claimed responsibility for the attack, but local officials have blamed the Taliban militants for the attack. Now, similar such suicide attacks took place in Khalat, the capital of the Zabul province. The head of Zabul's provincial council, Atajan Hagbayan, three others have been wounded in the suicide attack in the province. Now, Hagbayan had left his home to go to office. No group, including Taliban, has claimed responsibility for the blast so far. So this is the latest that is coming in from Afghanistan, where there are at least two separate incidents of blasts that have been reported. One in Ghazni, where about 23 people are said to have lost their lives. This, of course, is a developing story. We'll be getting you more details as they emerge.